I couldn't be more proud to stand before the graduating class of 2019 that includes the highest number of African American women cadets in the history of the United States Military Academy. And as you just heard, the school now making history because it's graduating the largest number of African American women in its 217 years. The school says that its 2019 graduating class is also the most diverse ever by both race and gender. And one of those graduates joins me now, West Point Second Lieutenant Nikaya Comer. Nikaya is from North Point, North Port, Florida, I should say. She majored in engineering and psychology. She will go on to assume duty at Fort Riley after acting as director of operations for women's soccer at West Point for six months. Congratulations to you, Nikaya Comer. Thank you for being with us. I'm just wondering, how does it feel to be a part of this historic class? Uh, sir, thank you for having me. Uh, this feeling is absolutely unbelievable. There are definitely no words to put into a sentence to describe how I feel about this. All of our work these past four years uh, have just all come together on this day, and this is awesome. <laughs> it is awesome. Um, I want to get your thoughts on a photograph. We're going to show it to our audience. I know you can't see it right now, but you have seen it, the significance of this picture. Women of color in uniform graduating in record numbers, 34. And I'm wondering, what does that represent to you personally? Uh, personally, sir, I think that represents uh, where the academy has come from and where they're going. I think that's a testament to... Uh, West Point as a whole and also the African-American women who have uh, put themselves in the situation to succeed at West Point. Uh, but I think it's a good sign. I am definitely blessed to be a part of that and I hope that we can continue that as the years uh, continue. As you know, this is a very divisive time in our country's history, but you all have an opportunity to show strength that comes from diversity. How will you demonstrate that in your military career? Showing strength through diversity, I guess taking on every situation head on, uh, free heart, open mind, willing to do whatever it takes to get the job done, not sticking to a one set plan and just taking all that West Point has taught us and using that uh, for any future situations that we run into. And what do you want to accomplish now as a graduate? What's next for you? Oh, what's next, sir? I'll stay here for uh, six months after graduation, uh, work with the soccer team as the director of operations position, which I am very excited about. And then after that, I will head to Fort Riley, Kansas, and uh, kick off my career as a quartermaster officer. In 2014, we know that West Point um, moved to not just actively recruit more women and minority students, but to diversify its leadership. And I'm wondering, how important is it to have a leader or classmates come from the same background as you do? I think it's uh, pretty fantastic. Like most people, when you see uh, someone that has a similarity to you, you tend to go towards that bond and you tend to work together better. Uh, but I think that although it is good, it is also uh, good to have people from all different backgrounds as well. Because when we get into the real army and when we are in the position to lead other people, our soldiers are going to come from all different backgrounds. So it's very important for us to be able to lead uh, anyone from any background and be able to connect with them on a special level. Yeah, well put. Um, you've written dozens of letters to elementary school students, uh, pen pals in California, urging them to dream big. Uh, how does it feel now knowing that you're blazing trails for those young students? Uh, sir, it, it feels incredible. I hope that they can look at me and maybe think that they can do this too and they can definitely be in my shoes and that anything that they want to do is possible and that there are no limitations on their dreams. <laughs> well, I know they look up to you. I know we look up to you. Cadet Nikaya Comer, thank you very much for being with us today and congratulations. Thank you, sir.